Hello and welcome back to Rumor Had the Music News and Gossip. But you're here from me, John Fat Joe, and Vice President Kamala Harris as they engage in a thought provoking discussion on justice reform. Kamala Harris talks about the recent pardons issued by Vice President Harris and President Joe Biden for individuals previously incarcerated for non violent marijuana related offenses. Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Fat Joe live from the White House. You know, I do my thing with healthcare, price transparency, but today I've been called by the Madam Vice President to be the moderator on justice reform and cannabis reform. Hey, everybody. Voila. So, Yo, Bay Area. Bay Area. <laughs> 106.1 KML, you remember that? I, that was a legendary right. radio thing. If I got my record, Chewy right. Gum, let you me tell you something, Chewy, Chewy Gum, if I got my record played there, I was big right. time. Chewy, Chewy in the you morning. You know, they call me the East Coast <laughs> E-40. It's okay. No, no, that's All what right. they call me. I'm, uh, this is a video for another purpose. No, but we... we <laughs> that's what Chewy, I love Chewy, and I right, miss him too. Okay, so here we are. Let's talk about why I was invited to moderate, and um, I leave everything for you. So we're here today because under our administration, Joe Biden and my administration, we have pardoned people who have been convicted of under the federal law for marijuana offenses for simple possession. And as far as I'm concerned, nobody should have to go to jail for smoking weed. So Fat Joe's with us here today to talk about how the lives of the people who have been pardoned have been affected by this. And frankly, all the, more, the work that we have to do. We have done work that has also been about having the Small Business Association stop preventing people who've been previously incarcerated from getting loans. So now people who are previously incarcerated can get loans. We are making sure that as those who are incarcerated are coming out, that they are connected with Medicaid benefits before they leave. So when they come out, they can re-enter and do what they want to do in terms of living a productive life. I'm honored to be here. I'm your moderator today. Thank you, Madam Vice President. Thank you, Fat Joe. And we're going to make it happen. See you later. Well, some people think Fat Joe made a mistake by talking with Vice President Kamala Harris. They say Harris locked up many black and Hispanic people in California for having marijuana. They believe Fat Joe shouldn't have uh, agreed to meet with her because it might make her look better. They don't trust her and don't think she'll keep her promises. Others think it's important to talk with leaders, even if we disagree with them. They say it's a way to make them listen to our concerns. They believe Fat Joe's meeting could help change things for the better. It's okay for people to have different opinions about this. What matters is that we talk about it and try to understand each other. What do y'all think?